Hello everybody, and welcome to Fridays with Jean. Now, as you can tell, I'm wearing the same shirt as I was last week, but that's because these videos have been recorded in the same day to save time. Now this week is a free week, meaning we can talk about whatever we want, however we want, as long as it's okay for family viewing. Currently, I am on the road to Wisconsin, so Craig is taking care of the uploads. Now, I'm really terrified of heights. Like, I have extreme vertigo, it is ridiculous. But, that doesn't mean that I won't go on a plane. No. I'm, I'm very reluctant to, but once I get on it, I'm pretty much okay. I just can't look at the window. But I love to travel. I've been pretty much all over the western side of the states, except California. <laughs> now, before I started going on trips, I was in public school. I had just started sixth grade, and I had only been at the school for about a month and then I got pulled into homeschooling because I found out I was going on my first trip to Pullman, Washington and I got to see and meet my cousin Jenny, one of Ashley's sisters, and I got to meet my cousins Sierra, Aubrey, and Jacob. It was a good trip. I mean we went out for Halloween, we had fun, Aubrey scared the piss out of this little Asian lady because she was kind of dressed up like the grudge and the lady kind of slammed the door in our face and turned off all the lights and hid. But it was still a really fun trip. I found the first cute boy I ever liked there. We're not going to talk about that experience. But it was a really nice trip. And my second and third trip were the same thing. All the way up to Washington. Driving from Colorado all the way up to Pullman, Washington. Now, during one of our trips... My Aunt Leah, Ashley's mom, and one of Ashley's friends decide it was time for their girls to meet. And that's how we met our friend Jamie. Now I'm pretty sure that the place we actually got to meet Jamie for the first time in person was a McDonald's parking lot in Wyoming. Now Jamie was this really pretty girl. She had really nice brown eyes and she had crazy colored hair all the time and she always had, like, the most awesome outfits and everything, and she's just really funny, too. Unfortunately, I'm not quite sure whatever happened to Jamie, but at least we got to meet her once. Then there was my trip to Florida. Now, during my trip to Florida, I got to meet three of my greatest friends ever, Jackson, Haley, and Austin. And they've had such a big impact on my life the last, like, four or five years that we've known each other that it was to the point that I didn't want to leave Florida once I met them. I was seriously considering asking my aunt if I could stay down there with them. Unfortunately, the trips to Florida had to stop because my aunt decided that they were moving up to Seattle. Now, during my trip to Seattle last summer, Ashley introduced me to some pretty amazing people. I got to go to Battle of the Bands and meet some of the best people there, too. And during Battle of the Bands, you know, we were in this bar, and they kicked out all of the people that were underage. So they kicked out the majority of the crowd for Battle of the Bands. There were so many people protesting this outside and getting so angry that all of the judges that were inside listening to the final band, which were these really old guys with long, long beards, and they looked like bikers. Now, all the judges had to come outside because they kicked out pretty much all but one band. Because all of these people that were playing in Battle of the Bands are young and up and rising musicians. And they are just amazing. But let me tell you, once those judges came out and they were calling out band names and people were screaming and yelling and having fun voting for their favorite artists, it just made the night all that much better. And to even make the night like a perfect night. Our friends in the band Seize the Sun, they got to go on to the next round of Battle of the Bands. And so now we've caught up to where I am now on the road to Wisconsin. So that's gonna be it for this video. I know I made it a lot longer than all of the other videos and then I was really supposed to, 
But I think at this point, it was worth it because you get to hear stories about amazing people. And I'll probably post videos on my channel talking about all of these people. So before it gets too long, I just wanted to say thank you to everybody that has ever introduced me to somebody that has ever said hello to me and introduced themselves because you have all turned out to be amazing people with huge impact in my life. And I really hope to meet more of you and just have good times and make some good memories. I may or may not decide to put my channel to use, my own channel to use, but I just might make more videos like this because I love telling people about all the great times and all the bad times that took a turn for the better. And I just like to tell people about it because you can learn so much from someone about their lives just by listening to the way they talk and just by staying there and listening. And you can connect to so many people by doing this. But if I do decide to use my channel to start talking about phenomenal people I've met, then I want to start talking about you and me and all the times that we've had together. I want you to introduce yourself to me, to Craig, and Ashley, and we can all just have a really good time. I mean, Craig and Ashley, they are awesome people. You know, they're, they're my family. They're awesome. And I'm sure you're pretty awesome too, so what are you waiting for? This is going to have to do it. So, thank you all. This has been Fridays with Jinx, and I look forward to seeing you next Friday. Bye-bye.